Good morning, YouTube. Good morning. Say good morning, Muffin. She loves drawstrings like this, so she's going to have a heyday with my outfit today. What is going on, guys? Welcome to today's video. I hope that you are all having a wonderful day so far. It is about 11 a.m., and I just got home from a back workout. Hit it hard this morning. I was at home before 10, which was nice. I didn't do cardio today because I'm doing cardio six days a week, so I only had to leave Muffin for 45 minutes, and you guys, she's been so good. She's been so good, honestly. As much as having a puppy is a handful, she is learning quite fast. Oh, let me show you. Let me show you. I got her little treats here. Good girl. <laughs> she knows to sit for them now. You're so good, honey. Starting the day off strong, ate breakfast this morning. I'm gonna do a full day of eating for you guys. I'm actually gonna go to the grocery store as well. I wanna switch up my meals today. I'm like a creature of habit and I just love eating the same things. Um, but I do wanna switch it up for your guys' sake. You guys are gonna have a full day of eating, a day in the life, and hang out with me and Little Miss Muffin. I'll give you guys a prep update as well. All right, I'm literally starving right now. Let me show you guys what I'm going to have post-workout. First things first, my coffee Coffee this morning is my second coffee of the day and I really wanted Starbucks so I decided to say no and make my own protein mocha here so there's a cup of coffee I use the Nespresso virtue line I always get asked what my favorite ones are so I really like this Milazio I believe it's called this is it so that one and then this Alto is a really tall one, so that's good to have like two coffees in one. But yeah, I have a cup of coffee in there. I have some steamed almond milk. This is the frother. It's the Nespresso brand frother. It's the only one that I know that works with almond milk, and this is the only almond milk that works. The unsweetened original 30 cal silk brand. So then I have one scoop of my One Up Nutrition chocolate vegan protein in there. I've been making hot cocoa and I just love it, but today I made a hot mocha, coffee and chocolate. Okay, let me take my first sip because the first sip is always the best. Mm. Oh yeah. Okay. So today is 13 weeks out from my first pro show. Very exciting news. I am pumped to just get back on stage again and just get more experience being on stage again because it's been a couple years and like I said in the last competition, I was vibrating a lot more than I thought that I would. It was just a very like overwhelming new feeling again because it had been so long. So I want to get back on stage like quite frequently so that I can build up that confidence again. So I'm excited to do that, get some more stage time, and actually experience a pro stage. It's very exciting things. Um, the competition is going to be in California, in LA, no sorry, Long Beach, April 6th. So if you guys are in the area, I would love to meet you and have you at my show. That would be super, super cool. And then we can meet after the show. So stay tuned for that if that is something that interest you guys and you want to come I would love it and I'll let you guys know when tickets are on sale things that we are going to be improving is well an overall package we want to come with a new and improved package so things that we're working on specifically are my hamstrings and my glutes we're putting a lot of focus on those areas so those are just areas that I need to improve on as an athlete. I am completely happy with the way that I look right now. I'm just keeping you guys in the loop. I know I get a lot of questions about if I still get my period and stuff like that, and I did. I do say that quite often. I'm actually getting my period next week, and the goal will always be to keep my period, you guys. If for any reason I lose it in this um, like competition season and stuff like that, or this competition journey that I'm on again, I will stop competing until I get the period back. I'm not I'm not down to sacrifice my health and my hormones and how hard I've worked to get to this point for vanity reasons it's just not gonna happen so just want you guys to know that so that is the prep prep update I need to drink my second coffee so that I can talk straight today is going to be a full day of eating so I did eat breakfast already I'll show you guys right here this is the second thing that I'm having post-workout uh, protein mocha so 
that is that. I will see you guys at the next meal, which will be in like 45 minutes. <laughs> Second favorite meal of the day next to breakfast. I have some sweet potatoes that I baked on 400 for like an hour until soft. And then the salmon, I always cook it for 25 minutes. I like it medium rare. Air fried green beans, sriracha. Um, what is that? Sugar free barbecue sauce. <laughs> I know you're getting stuff done when you have your glasses on and a top bun, right? Right? Am I right? Okay guys, a couple hours later, it is now 3.30 and I've just been sitting, getting work done. I commented back to all of my YouTube comments. I have a challenge going right now, so I commented back to those girls, did some stuff on my website. Um, I'm also looking into getting some merch, I should probably face this way, some merch. So I emailed some distributors and yeah, it's been a really productive day. So now I'm gonna go to the grocery store and get some stuff to make the next meal. Also, I wanna show you guys my little workspace. It's pretty sad right now, but this is just like my little nook that I sit at and I just got a new monitor. So I wanna show you guys this space just so that you could see what it looks like right now, the wall, because I ordered a bunch of stuff from Amazon and it should be here at the beginning of the week. So I'm so excited to show you guys like my little revamped office space once it's done. So stay tuned for that. Oh, muffin, sit. Oh, you're so good. <laughs> also wanna let you guys know that my whole entire outfit today is Buff Bunny Collection. This is a cute little matching jogger set. These are the Jasmine joggers in mauve, and then the matching cropped hoodie, and then I have the marble uh, sports bra on underneath. On underneath. On a scale of one to 10, how extra do I look? Teddy, matching jogger set, matching tumbler from Starbucks. I was going for like an eight. So when I'm in prep, I really like to eat this new pasta. It's a konjac root, whatever the heck that is, but it's 25 calories. It's a vegetable pasta. There's no soy and it's gluten-free. And look at the macros. So it's just really good to add volume to your meals and it's pure fiber. So I'm gonna get one of those for a meal tonight. All right, guys, I'm so sorry that I look like this for you, but this is what I'm gonna look like the rest of the night. If my mom was watching this or with me right now, she'd be like, take your hair down. She hates when I do this top knot. <laughs> okay, so I just got back from the grocery store. I stopped at Savon and then co-op. I never go to co-op and I just wanted to see what they had. So I did get a couple things that I'm going to be making dinner with tonight. So yeah, let me show you guys what I got. I got some cold brew, just unsweetened cold brew. Sometimes I want to switch it up from hot coffee. Then I got some more unsweetened almond milk. I got one cucumber. Why are cucumbers so expensive right now? I got this brand, I don't even know how you say this. It's like Kunan Antica. This brand of tomato sauce is so good. There's no added sugar. I've had it before. I really like it on spaghetti squash, which I literally just thought of. I'm wishing that I did get that. Oh, I love spaghetti squash. But today we're going to be making pasta with new pasta, the konjac root noodles, the konjac root noodles that I showed you guys. So like I said, this is my favorite um, pre-made tomato sauce. It only has tomatoes, onions, extra virgin olive oil, salt, basil, white pepper, and black pepper in it. And then the nutrition is super good. So we're gonna be using that. Then I also got some ready cut fajita mix vegetables, just a bunch of peppers and red onions. I'm gonna be using that for our pasta as well. Got some shrimp, that will be our protein in that meal. Then I got some broccoli slaw and some nori wraps. So this is going to be like a wrap. I'm gonna make it in my next meal, a fish wrap. So you guys are gonna to have to like fish in order to like this meal but I'll show you guys. And then my favorite vegetable along with green beans is broccolini. I just wish it was more like cheaper. This was five, $5.99, but that's okay. So 
I'm gonna get to making our super fast next meal. Literally, it's gonna be so fast, so let me show you what we're having. All right, guys, when I said this meal was gonna be super simple, I wasn't kidding. I have the broccoli slaw in there, and then the tilapia that we prepped, I just diced it all up and mixed it in. I'm using these two as sauces, soy-free coconut aminos, and this sesame ginger, it's amazing. And then I'm also going to put a little bit of kimchi in there. All right, so that literally took like five to seven minutes to saute everything together. Let me show you guys what we're working with. I will tell you guys that I got this idea for this meal from my best friend Paige. Her Instagram is that blonde bikini girl, and this is one of her like budget friendly recipes. I love salad rolls, but in prep my carbs are limited, so I'm totally taking her up on this recipe. It's such a good idea. This is the first time I'm making it on my own though, so let's hope it goes as planned and I can roll the nori papers. Fingers crossed, otherwise we're just gonna eat it all like a stir fry. <laughs> so here I have the nori papers and I cut up some cucumber just to keep like structure, make it a little bit harder in the roll. And then we have everything that we stir fried, the broccoli slaw, kimchi, and fish. And then this is just a little bit of the coconut aminos with like some random salad dressings that I had in the fridge just as a sauce. So let's see if this goes as planned. gosh you guys look at that I used three nori wraps and I cut them all in half and look how many I got this is such a calorie friendly meal and super easy to make and I'm really proud of myself she would be proud of me too like look at that compactness and then I'm gonna use the rest of this that I didn't use as dipping oh how fun I'm proud muffin good I don't need to just see you you're so good I love you. Two hours later. You guys know our next meal is going to be some pasta. We have the new pasta, the fajita cut vegetables, our spice, our protein, and our sauce. So first things first, we have to rinse this thoroughly. Just do it until you think it's good enough. So the thing with this pasta is that it takes a little while to cook and get to the texture that you want it to. So I'm gonna let this simmer for probably about 15 minutes to be honest, and then the shrimp are gonna be added last. Looking good, I added some onion powder, some black pepper, and some garlic salt on there. Almost done. And here we have the finished product, you guys. A super low-cal, voluminous filling shrimp pasta last meal of the day my faithful my one true just kidding i don't know i love this meal is basically what i'm saying we have egg whites some pink himalayan salt cinnamon and almond butter all right you guys i got my blue light blocking glasses on so that is going to be it for this video i'm sitting here with my top bun still editing and yeah, I'm gonna finish it, get it up for you guys. Hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please do not forget to show your support by giving the video a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I love you guys. Thank you for being here, as always. I'll see you in the next one. So it is 10.30, I just finished editing the video. I'm about to make my nightly cocktail, and I figured this is too good not to share with you guys. I'm like whispering, because my dog is literally snoring. <laughs> Uh, but it's too good not to share, but share it with you guys. You might already know about it, and if you don't, well, now you do. It's going to relax you, turn your mind off, just get you in a good place where you want to sleep. Sometimes my mind just like does not shut off, and I could be laying there for hours. So it relaxes you, and then it also gives you a really good poop in the morning. Might be TMI, maybe not. This is what it is. 
So the One Up Nutrition Beauty Dream is my favorite supplement. I travel with this often. You guys have seen it before. It just relaxes you and gives you a really nice deep sleep. Wake up feeling rest rested. And then the magnesium also helps to relax you. So these two together is like my favorite thing ever. Really just relaxes the crap out of you and it gives you such a good poop in the morning. So yeah, I put two tablespoons of that in there. Take two capsules and that's it. Oh, 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 oh,